this be true? How much were they paid? Is the question on everyone's lips. As Ohanieses speaks on dumping Peter Obi to endorse Tinubu. I don't think that's true at all. You know, no man will leave his own son and be cheering for his friend's son when both of them are on the same race and competing for the same uh, medal. Okay, Peter Obi is a man who is not just seen as a Southeasterner, but somebody who could bring the new face of Nigeria to reality. People who are cheering for him are not necessarily uh, people from the Southeast. I mean, it's about time for a new change. But this uh, news has kept going on for some time now that, um, you know, uh, Wanyese Zindigo has dumped their very own son Okay, from which region Peter will be hails uh, to support Tinubu? Uh, I mean, do you believe that yourself? Exactly, exactly my thought. I don't think you do. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. God bless. The Apex Evil Social Cultural Organization, Ohanieze Zindigo, has debunked speculations that it has dumped the presidential candidate of the All Progress of the Labour Party, Peter Obi, to endorse the All Progressive Congress candidate, Ashiwaju Ahmed Bolatinabo. The group, in a statement on Tuesday, said the immediate past president of Ohanieze Zindigo Worldwide Lagos State Chapter, Solomon Agu was responsible for paddling that news because he wants to please Tinubu at all costs. The current president of Ohanese in the Bolego State, Sunday Osinach, is the only authorized person to speak on behalf of the group. The group added that the misleading impression of dumping Peter Obi is from the pit of hell and meant to serve and meant to severe the private interest and the interest of all to cause a distraction. The statement reads, the attention of Ohanieses in the worldwide has been drawn to the news making rounds with a caption, Ohanieses in the Bulls, Dump Peter Obi declares support for Tinubu. The story added that since the group was in support of a second tenor for the governor Babajide Sanwolu of Lagos State, there was nothing wrong in supporting his Sanwolu's presidential candidate. The, the, the movers of this very mark is Chief Solomon Agu, the immediate past president of Ohanese in the worldwide Lagos State chapter. In line with the constitution of the apex social cultural body, an electoral panel headed by a seasoned technocraft in the person of Mazi Okechuku was constituted by the President General of the Ohanese Zindibo, Ambassador Professor George Obiza, with a mandate to conduct a fresh election for the Lagos State chapter. Information reaching Ohanese Zindibo indicates that Agu has secured a tenor elongation from the Lagos court. This is to say the very list. Ohanez Zindigo therefore informed the general public that the current president of Ohanez Zindigo, Lagos State Chapter Chief Sunday Osas, and only is the only chapter president authorized officer of the current Lagos State Chapter that has the right to speak on behalf of Ohanez's Indigos in Lagos State. Ohanez's believe that any person with a democratic credibility will disassociate himself from such a person who conducts himself in an unworthy manner in the public. His statements are his own views, are his own position, and not that of the Ohanieses in the bus. So, I mean, you can hear the correction being made in those regards. Yes, uh, what we heard previously to this time was that uh, Ohanieses in the bus have dumped their son, Peter Obi, to endorse, you know, uh, Shiwajo Ahmed Bola Tinobu. Well, uh, the reverse has come saying we can't do that. We can't possibly do that, okay? 
anymore. We can't possibly do that because the truth of the matter is if so my wonderful people, I mean Ohanias Zindigo has corrected that impression. It was the former president of the organization in Lagos State who is benefiting seriously from the Lagos State government. Okay. Uh, the governor of Lagos State has given him an you know a political appointment and has elongated that appointment and hence the guy cannot be grateful enough that to sell his own brother for a pot of porridge. You know, some people will castigate Esau saying, Ah, that man Sha, he has no integrity at all. How can he sell his bed right for a pot of porridge? Do you know what people people sell for less than at least he eats the porridge? People sell for less than that. When you when you do what you're not supposed to do, for instance, you castigate Peter Obi because you want to endorse Tinubu and all that, and you know what you are doing is wrong, it's not for your good, it's not for your people. Is that not you selling your own bed right? I mean, so the people sell their bed right in all forms of ways and everything. But the Haniers is in the books are making the correction that whatever impression has been put out there in the general public, it's not their it's not the general it's not their idea, it's not the general agreement of the organization and and um Oh, and yes, Zindigos are not part of it. It, it. This man, nobody should have any dealings with him because he's doing his own thing, you know. So they're just putting out a correction notice out there. Well, my wonderful people, get ready to hear all kinds of things, all kinds of words, you know, as the elections draw closer. You'll be surprised. Many more will still come. This is just a tip of the iceberg. Many more will still, we know, will still unfold in regards to who is supporting who and who has left who it's still going to come okay it's not just going to uh, work no no it's still more and more it's still going to be revealed over this area but remember that every one of us must make up our mind you must be resolute on the candidate you want to support uh, you can't just get there and you are wondering so who do i support so a or b c or d no no you can't do that we have to be ready you know our minds have to be set we have to have made that choice okay say when we are sure we are standing by it is a binding decision this is what we are doing and this is why we are taking this decision and guess what whatever comes out of that we know that we are responsible for the consequences of the actions we have taken you know so these are the days upon us elections are right around the corner and it's expedient that everyone you know is is, is on track Okay, and we are all in it together. Otherwise, things may, you know, not go very well, and, and the wrong persons may become the ones, you know, that are uh, becoming leaders when it, that should not be the case. Well, it is what it is. Leave us a comment. Don't forget to like us, share, subscribe, click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news. Bye for now.